What's up guys, Dan here with Bitter Tech, and I previously launched a video telling you how to make custom icons with your iPhone. The problem with that video was that you had to launch Siri shortcuts every time you wanted to open an app, just like this. Now fortunately, we've got a brand new way to go about this that lets you open apps without using Siri shortcuts. Let's get into it. Okay, so the app we're talking about today is Launch Center Pro. They do all kinds of customizations for your iPhone, one of which is changing your icons, which you can see as shown right here. Now, the downside to all of this is that if you use an Apple app shortcut, it's going to open Siri in order to open, but if you use any third-party icons, then they'll work without opening shortcuts. You're gonna need a Pro membership to Launch Center Pro in order to take advantage of these features and add an icon to your home screen. You can get a free trial for seven days, and then after that, you have to pay. So let's go ahead and get started. So in Launch Center Pro, you're gonna hit Edit at the top corner, create a new action. You're gonna to go to the icon here. And so under the style, you can upload your own image, or you can choose one of their styles. And under the glyph, you've got all kinds of custom icons here that are uploaded into the app. From random symbols all the way to third-party services as well. We're going to go ahead and make one for Spotify. You can change the color to whatever you want here. And again, you can change the style to however you want that to look. You can customize your badge to change for that app as well. And once you're done, hit the plus button. You're gonna find the app. And you're gonna hit add. And then you're gonna hit add to home screen. It's gonna prompt you to download a profile here. You're gonna hit allow. And then it tells you review the profile in settings. So now we're gonna to go to our settings app and you can see profile downloaded. We're gonna hit install. Enter your passcode and hit install. After that, you can see your new home screen here and it opens right away. So that's everything. Let me know what you guys think in the comments of this, if you're gonna be changing your shortcuts to now use this app instead of Siri. As always, hit that subscribe button to see more from me and hit that like button because it tells YouTube that this video doesn't suck. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you in the next one.